YouTube, after 16 duels, we went 93.75% win rate, 15 wins, one loss. Let's do it. There can only be one winner, and you're looking at it. Let's go. Amano Awato. This card is so damn good. If you do not have it, make sure you use your Casey Cup Stage 2 tickets on it because it was a farm event. But you could use your Casey Cup tickets on it still. So hopefully you did not use it yet. You waited for some videos from me or advice from me on what to use your tickets on because this deck is incredibly good. Do you hate any deck that activates monster effects? You know, every top tier deck there is. Despacito, Shien, Dark Lords. Well, Amano Awado says no monster effects can be activated while this is on the field, except spirit monsters. Now, what's the big downside of Amano Awado? It must go back to your hand in your end phase. But we stop that through dual standby. Dual standby makes it so you and your opponent open up with five cards in their opening hand. And then you cannot activate spell, traps, or monster effects in your first turn. So the negative effect of it going back to your hand in the end phase is negated on your first turn. So once you get them out on the first turn, you basically win. You set up a bunch of back row. Easy scoop. Alongside Amano Awado is Guardian Yitos. Guardian Yidos can be special summoned from the hand, is not negated by Amano Awado, as long as you have no monsters in your graveyard. We plan to never have monsters in the graveyard because we have so much protection. It's lit. Now, what do we use to protect the Amano Awado? We are using the counter trap engine of Rebirth of Parshath. If they activate a spell, trap, or monster effect, negate it, shuffle it back in the deck, and then summon a Parshath from your extra deck. 2600 attack can change a battle position of a monster on the field, and it deals piercing damage, which is not negated by Amano Awado. So the great thing with the Parshath is you get Parshath out by negating something, and then you use Concentrating Current on your Parshath. So big shout out to the top global players of the KC Cup that use this deck. There were quite a few, and that's where we got the inspiration for this deck. You target a monster, it gains attack equal to its defense. So your Parshath becomes 4,700 attack with piercing damage. This is also a great card to protect your Amano Awado. If they attack into Amano Awado, it becomes 3,100 attack. And your Yidos becomes 4,500 attack. Now we have Clash. Clash will protect your Amano Awado. Clash is the best protection card in Duel Links. Now, if you Draw your Amano Awado outside of turn one. What you need to do is set your Amano Awado, then clash it when they attack into it, so it comes back in the end phase, and then it will stay on the field. If you normal summon Amano Awado, then use clash. When it comes back in the end phase, it's gonna go back to your hand. So it's only on flip beyond the first turn is how you gotta use clash. We are using Dark Bribe in addition to our Rebirth of Parshat because you must reveal a counter trap in order to activate this and then discard any card in your hand. You could play this with six counter traps if you want. Any card you're missing, cut the current. If you do not have a dark bribe, another great card is called Wiretap. Wiretap, very similar to Dark Bribe. We use Dark Bribe mostly to negate traps. Dark Bribe, negate a spell or trap, then your opponent gets to draw a card. Instead, you could use Wiretap, which is another counter trap. Negate a trap goes back in the deck. Now it's worth noting, all counter traps cannot be negated by Shien. So if there's a Shien on the field, no problem. You are completely protected from Shien. Apparently a lot of cards have Shien in their name, so I can't show you Shien. So Rebirth of Parshaf cannot be negated by Shien. Then we got Wall D for extra protection. They get so desperate to take out your Amano Awado. You flip up the D, give them the D. 15 and one, love it. How about it? Whoa, okay. All righty. I'll double rebirth. It's so crazy it's gonna work. He's gonna activate something. There's no way. Could you imagine he doesn't? I'm going balls deep for it. Triple negate, triple Parshath. That's how we do it. 
Cosmic negates. Reveal the dark bribe. Discard the wall D. Do not negate your own Parshaf. Back to the deck. Come forth, Parshaf. Now, usually you wouldn't do this. This is just to be funny. We would definitely not negate that. But we want to resolve all three. Wind. 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 I gotta negate you. <laughs> Sorry. Fool. Back to the deck. We draw a counter trap. We are Sugoi. What the hell is this video? Most complicated way to summon Exodia. What? Thank you, Resident. What's my opinion on Vision Hero Poisoner? I don't really have an opinion on it. I have to look into it. Ooh, got the Clash. He's got a Kanadia, I'm thinking. He got Kanadia. We know it. You know it. That's a Kanadia. Econ? Sure. Sure. Take that 26. We draw on a counter trap next turn. Believe it. Believe it! Setting Dark Bribe was better. Are you out of your mind? Are you crazy? Fortunately, calling? That's fine. We win with the, the, the Clash. It's it. It's done. Econ, take him. You see Econ in my face down? Huh? What you talking about? You don't got Black Rose. I know you don't. I know you don't. We'll clash it if we do. If you got it, wait. <sighs> what do I tell you? What did I tell you? Do not target the light. He targeted the wrong card. That's why when we played Fortune Ladies, I kept saying, do not target the light. Wow. He screwed it up. He screwed it up. That's it. You blew it. <laughs> that you, uh, I, what do I say? What do I say? Puppet. YouTube, that best be a lesson for you. You know it. You know it. Now, is this a, a, a rock with a nose on it, right? This is a face. Am I the only one who sees a face here? This is like the Deku tree. Ready? Three, two, one. Too late. No monster effects. You cannot activate beta. You fool. Guardian, Yitos. Yeet on him. We got the concentrating current. We got the rebirth of Parshaf. This deck is nuts. No sphere Kribo, no beta, nothing. Wait, we can't concentrating. That's okay. That's okay. It's not that good. It's not that good where we could just go yeet. All right, let's go. We'll discard the bribe to negate anything. And we got a clash. No monster effects, man. What you thinking? What you thinking? We will go in. Whatever it is. Wall a D. Negate. We are playing the best deck. Reveal the Dark Bribe. Discard the Dark Bribe. Come forth, Parshath. And the crazy thing about Parshath is it deals piercing damage, which is not negated by the Amano Awado. It's not even negated. Yes. Set, set, set. Could set a rebirth. It's got no delay in the back row, nothing. Yidos. Yeet on him. This could be a treacherous, but no one's playing treacherous. Big balls. Huge. And the Yidos would be useless after a treacherous anyway. Got the clash. I think we got to keep the clash in case it is. Holy crap. Holy crap. Yeet on him. 
Canadia. Wait, we can't activate cards the first turn anyway. Keep forgetting that. Keep forgetting that. When we want to make aggressive turn one plays, you cannot activate them on the first turn. First slip up. It's okay. It's okay. Hopefully it's not relevant. Kaka doodle do. Level eight synchro. Level eight. Red dragon archfiend. What the? Ends his turn. Are you out of your damn mind? What the? Flip. Concentrating current. Ba boost. Negate. Discard. Yes, I want to summon. Avenging Knight Parshath. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Amano. Yitos. Yeet on him. Oh, man. Oh, man. You know what? No wyvern. No wyvern effect, okay? We're good. No wyvern effect. He's going to swing wyvern into a mono wado, and we're going to concentrate in current. No! Hit the middle! Yes! He's got double cyclone. Ah! He's got everything! My boost! Set Wyvern. <laughs> yes! Come forth, Amano. It's time to finish this fool. Wow. Wow. What the? No monster effects. Get out of here. Back to Fortnite! Yes!